Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to go ahead and use the um, Smashbox Studio Skin Foundation. This is the 15 hour wear hydrating foundation in the shade 1.0. I have already moisturized my face. I'm going to go ahead and use the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. Also, I have been using the e.l.f. Poreless Face Primer. Okay, now that my face is primed, I'm going to go ahead and get started with the eyes. So I'm going to go ahead and start off by priming the eyes. I'm going to use the Maybelline uh, Concealer. I'll be using the Jaclyn Hill Palette for more of her warm tones, um, the browns, a little bit of the oranges that she has. But I do want to use the Dominique Cosmetics one for either, like I said, the Macchiato or the Creme Brulee, just to give that, that real pretty glitter. I'm going to be wearing liner and falsies so I'm looking for something just a little dramatic. I'll be using the shade Silk Cream from the Jaclyn Hill palette go ahead and go on my um, eyelids here. I went ahead and used the shade Silk Cream as my transition shade so I will go ahead and use the shade let's do MFEO and that is the shade that's right next to it so I started off with this one and now I'll be using this one. And I'm just going to go ahead and go over that exact same spot that I did before. So I will be going in with the shade um, Mocha, this bottom shade right here. And I will be deepening up the transition area. So because the Jaclyn Hill palette doesn't have a soft matte shade, go ahead and go in with the Dominique Cosmetics palette. And I'll be using the shade um, Vanilla Cream. This is more of the banana shade that she has here. So I'm going to go ahead and go in with that one real quick. And this is on a Morphe B79 brush. I'm going to go ahead and go in with the shade Macchiato from the Dominique Cosmetics palette. I'm going to go ahead and go in with my finger instead of with a brush just to see how it um, applies. So I'm going to pick up another fluffy brush and go in with the color Caramel from the same palette just to fix the transition shade at the top. Now that that is done, I will go ahead and do my liner and lashes off camera and I will be right back. Guys, so now that my lashes and liner are on, I am going to go ahead and go in with the foundation. This is the Smashbox Studio Skin Foundation and this is in the shade 1. I'm going to go ahead and go in with a damp beauty blender where all this redness is coming from, but I don't like it. Okay, so next I will be going in with concealer. I'm going to use the same concealer I used to um, prime my lids with. Now I am going to go ahead and go in with the damp beauty blender and blend all that out as well. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and set that with the Laura Mercier setting powder. I'm going to go ahead and set the concealer with a beauty sponge. This, is, this isn't the same one I've been using. This is another one. I usually use this one for powder. So while that is setting, I'm going to go ahead and go in with the Hula Benefit bronzer. And I will be picking up just this fluffy brush. Alrighty, and for blush, I'm going to go ahead and go in with the Tartlet uh, blush. This is in the shade Celebrated. I actually dropped it and cracked it a little bit. My bad. And I will be going in with a Real Techniques blush brush. Now, I'm going to go ahead and just blend everything real quick before I get started with the um, highlight. So I'm going to go ahead and use my Sonia Kashuk uh, stippling brush and do that real quick. Now I am going to go ahead and dust off the bakage that I had going on. That way I can set the other parts of my face that were not set with um, either the translucent powder or the blush and bronzer. Next I will be doing my brows. This is the Anastasia 12 brush. This is the little eyebrow brush. Okay, so for my brows I am going to go ahead and use the Benefit Goof Proof uh, Brow Pencil. It just says three on the side. I don't know if that's the shade. This is the um, 
the little mini size. Okay, so now I'll be picking up the NYX Tinted Brow Mascara. I just have this one. It is in the shade Chocolate. Okay, so for highlighter, I'm going to go ahead and apply it with my damp beauty sponge this time. And I will be using the Becca Highlighter in Moonstone. Now I'm going to go ahead and take the pointy end of the beauty sponge and just kind of put it into the pan. And lightly dab my, my face. I don't know if the camera is picking it up, but I see it. A little bit down my nose. Can you see it? Can you see it on this side? I see it. Go in. All right. I am gonna go ahead and use this brown um, eyeliner and line my waterline. This is from NYX. Now I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this Elf smudge brush and go into my um, bronzer and smudge out the bottom lash line. Okay, so for the lips, I am going to go ahead and use the um, Patrick Star lipstick that he collaborated with MAC in the shade Mama Star. I am going to go ahead and add a little bit of the gloss that was in the collaboration as well, and this is in the shade Mama Star. I'm just going to go ahead and add that directly in the middle. And then to set the face, I'm going to go ahead and go back in with the primer water. Hey everyone, so this is the final result. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I do like it. I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial that I put together for you. And I hope to see you in my next video. Thank you. This brown um, eyeliner and line my waterline. This is from NYX in the shade duh